Hello, it is day four already of my 12 days of Christmas books. No, well, day, 12 days of Christmas and 12 days of books. Uh, we have a hardcover again. Super excited. I know that one of the hardcovers should be an Illumicrate or Fairy Loot or Owl Crate. No, I think Fairy Loot or Illumicrate exclusive. I hope it's an Illumicrate because I potentially already have all the Fairy Loots. Let's see. Um, yeah, really enjoying the wrapping again. I just think it's a fabulous idea how this is done. And um, I wish I could save all the paper. But then also I have nothing to use it for really. So yeah, probably gonna give it all to my mom. She like recycles paper like crazy. And this actually, the way I can open this actually saves a lot of the paper. It makes it really usable. <laughs> Not like the uh, advent calendar wrapping <laughs> that I couldn't get off. All right, I hope it's not middle grade again. Although with middle grade, there's a high possibility of me not having it yet and not having read it, but... Oh, I've seen this, Ever the Hunted. I have seen this and I think it's on my wish list. Um, I actually do enjoy this cover. I like this cover a lot. I am not sure what this is about. Oh, that's beautiful. It kind of looks like leather. I don't know if you can see this, but it's the way it's embossed, it kind of looks like it's leather. That's pretty cool. Um, I'm pretty sure that this is on my wish list, but I have no idea why. Ever the outcast, ever the brave. Probably very tropey, very predictable. <laughs> A uh, 17-year-old Britta Flannery is at ease only in the woods with her dagger and bow. Uh, she spends her days tracking criminals alongside her father, the legendary bounty hunter for the King of Malum. That is, until her father is murdered. Now outcast and alone and having no rights to her father's land or inheritance, she seeks refuge where she feels most safe, the Everwoods. When Britta is caught poaching by the royal guard, instead of facing the news, she's offered a deal. Her freedom in exchange for her father's killer. What? However, it's not so simple. I, I don't find this simple. How? Like, she's supposed to find the father's killer? I don't get it. Um, the alleged killer is none other than Cohen McKay, her father's former apprentice. The only friend she's ever known... The boy she once loved who broke her heart. Oh my gosh. Um, she must go on a treacherous quest in a world of warring kingdoms, mad kings, and dark magic to find the real killer. Oh, okay. The alleged killer. So people think that this Cohen is the killer, but it's her only friend. But by the way, also the person who broke her heart. This sounds so tropey. Uh... But Britta wields more power than she knows. Of course she does. Uh, and soon she will learn that what has always made her different will make her a daunting and dan dangerous force. Oh, it sounds very, very tropey. I don't know. It has a beautiful cover. Please, uh, have you read it? Did you like it? Let me know if this should go on top or more to the bottom of the pile. Um, it's a beautiful cover, though. So potentially it might be one to put in the shelf to look at. Um, well, I think it's on my wish list. So the person giving this to me did nothing wrong. Um, but... Reading it just doesn't spark joy at this point. Uh, please tell me this is good. <laughs> and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.